A community in the North Bay that might be considered to be in an underserved community. They got a new grocery store. And it's a grocery <laughs> outlet, which is awesome. It's in Marin City and Chrome Force Will Tran is live there. And customers are pretty excited. Oh my gosh, there's a line, Will? This might be the first time and the last time that you see a long line in front of a grocery store early in the morning. We saw people as early as 4 o'clock in the morning waiting in line because this is badly needed in the community. Grocery outlet, well, this used to be a CVS, but now it's a grocery store. A lot of people in this community, they have to walk to get the groceries, and it's such a big deal that they're even playing music at this particular time, entertaining the folks as they walk in. There are the owners right there. What they're doing is they're passing out envelopes. Could be $5, could be $500, but they're going in there because this is an underserved community. The nearest grocery store, a few miles away, or even a different city, and a lot of people, they don't have access to a car, or their bus doesn't take them there. So this is a big deal to the community and for people like Elijah. Thank you for joining me this morning. Your thoughts on this place finally opening to the community in Marin City. Uh, well, I'm glad that this is opened up to Marin City. This is a big thing for us. It's given us to utilize something that's in our community, and it's going to save time, gas, and it's something that we kind of need here. The prices are low, and I'm a chef myself. I've been waiting for things like this to open up in our community so it can really just do a lot more things than just one and having everybody do so much. A lot of people, they had a hard time buying groceries because they could not walk to the grocery store. This is a nice shopping center, but now they have a grocery store. What does that mean for a lot of other people? I know you can drive, but for other, maybe friends and neighbors, they don't have a car. Well, for other people like handicapped, it can save them time, money, and other things, you know, things that are being hurt. And it just does a lot for the community, let alone this store just brings a lot more value to the shopping center and the community. For other stores that's just around, not just for people personally, it's going to do a worldwide thing for the economics in its community. Okay, thank you so much, Elijah. I know you want to shop, 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 so go inside. Again, when's the last time you saw a DJ in front of a grocery store, but it's a big deal. I'm getting word from the owner. Hey, Julian, you're wanted back in produce. Is that so? Right now? Right now. Go back to produce. No, I'm just kidding. He is wanted in front because he's the entertainment. But you know what? The meat and potatoes, literally, that's inside. Back to you. All right. Pretty cool. Thanks a lot, Will. Good time. All right.